Hey Lightweights and welcome back to some more Ghost of Tsushima. Last video we just did a lot of the side tales with our friends. We did a lot of stuff for Norio, we did a lot of stuff for Yuna, um, and then we did another mission for Kenji. So I'm going to continue with those because I had the feeling that we were towards the end of Act 2. Um, you guys kind of confirmed that for me as well. Uh, so I'm going to keep doing these side missions. I'm gonna try to do a main mission, but I just don't know if I'm gonna have time because I still have so many of them, oops, sorry, so many of them left. Uh, so I'm not gonna do those small tales in this video just because that's like a lot um, as well. I'm not sure how I'm gonna fit those in. I am gonna do them on camera. I just have to figure out a game plan for them. Those are a little less critical to get to before I move on to Act 3. Uh, so I will continue to do those, just probably not for a little while. I really want to keep moving with the main story because that Ghost Dance mission was so freaking good and I'm really excited. I have a feeling the end of Act 2 is going to be amazing because the end of Act 1 was amazing. Um, but I really want to do these side tales with our crew before I do that, just because in my mind, like I said, that makes more sense. So I don't really know what this video will look like. It might be completely side tales again. I apologize for those of you who don't really like that, uh, but that's kind of just the nature when I want to do everything on camera for you guys. So I hope that you are excited for the video. If you enjoyed last video and you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next one. And I think that's it. So here we go. Jin. Yuna? What is it? A child's doll. Stained in blood. The Black Wolf enslaves children? Yes. And he sells them to the Mamushi brothers. Where is he? His camp's down this path, but it's crawling with Mongol guards. Then they will die with him. I need to be the one to kill the Black Wolf. I had a chance a long time ago. But I... I couldn't. I can help you. We'll attack head on. Let him know we're coming. I want him to feel helpless. Paralyzed. He will. And by the time we're finished, Altan will feel the same. This way. The Mongol. Others. Leave it to me. All right, just one. That's easy enough. <laughs> oh, I have no result. On the course. Let's go. All right, wind. Damn. You know this place well. Haka and I came here after we left Yarikoa. I thought it was a refuge. I was wrong. What? Oh, shit. I'm not in the grass. <laughs> Fuck it, let's do a stand-up. Come up, fight! Why not? Right. 
relax, dude. What the fuck? I don't see the black wolf. Oh. The coward likely fled. He can't get away. Wait, that Mongol ship offshore. He may be inside. It always takes me a minute to get back into the swing of things with this game. Where is he? Mongol screams will draw him out. All right. Whatever you think I've done, Altan forced me. You enslaved children! No, I- You've done it for 20 years! You held me and Taka captive, sold us to the Mamushi slave farm! Taka... He was my favorite. But the way I remember it, you brought him to me. I didn't know. You know, he's yours. Oh. Are you alright? Let's get off this boat. Burn it. Altan will see this and know we're coming. He'll be forced to act. Jin, what the Black Wolf said was the truth. What do you mean? I met him when we came to Otsuna. He offered me food and a place to stay. I asked if I could bring my brother. He got us drunk. And then... Taka doesn't remember, but I do. I was frozen. I could have killed him, saved Taka. But I was too scared. It's not your fault. Because of you, you'll never hurt another child. I need some time. I'm going back to the inn. I'll see you there. I really like the storyline, you guys. It's really cool seeing more into Yuna's past and understanding why she is the way that she is. This is the last one for Yuna, so let's do this one. What happened? Altan got her message. This was his answer. He said to meet him at a camp near the Kushi border. You'll pay for this. We will bring him to justice. You've brought nothing but death. It is our duty to exact revenge. We'll take it from Altan or die trying. That's the duty of a samurai. Yuna's just a thief. All and right, bitch. have no honor.
will make this right. I swear. Your promises are just like you. Worthless. Jen, Let's we're just going to let horses. her talk to you like that? For real? All right, Una. Let's go get this some um, son of a bitch. You know we're riding into a trap. I know, but I owe it to Ichi. Our focus has to be Altan. Whatever happened between you and her, they can't get in the way. You don't understand. Ichi was a slave at the Mamushi farm. It's where we met. She looked out for me and Taka. Shielded us from the worst. She's the reason we escaped. She chose to do that. You don't owe her anything. That's not all of it. We swore to get out of that place together. One moment, we were all running. The next, Ichi was screaming. <laughs> and I kept running. You were a kid. I abandoned her, Jin. I owe her my life. You were right to run. I saw what kind of men those brothers were. If you tried to fight them, they would have killed you. Is running part of the samurai code? You were children. Sometimes running is the only way to survive. What's done is in the past. You have to let go of your guilt. It will only get in the way when we face Altan. I don't let anything get in my way. Oh, that's not it. I was like, why does it say it's still 200, 200 meters away? Because it is. It. Be careful. We don't know how many men Altan brought with him. But where are the bastards hiding? All right, so we're gonna go in all sneaky like. Can we shoot? Good with that. Oh, that's pretty. Many people. Does that guy have a helmet on? He is. Okay. Tang Twin! Oh. Binning a clan. A lord and turba. Turn up the moon by Starla. Oh, 
Likes that we were over here. <laughs> it's him. I'll turn with I'll another turn. pack of dogs. I'm nervous for some reason now. I think because I just did that last part so I'll well. Turn. I'll turn. Face I'll judgment for your crimes. You cannot judge me. You murdered your own people. The Mamushi brothers and the Black Wolf are traitors. Is that your excuse? Your reason to become the ghost and kill? Uh, no yeah. No wonder the straw hat Ryuzo turned on you. Enough! You know nothing, Altan. It's time to finish this. Prepare to die. That was my best Princess Bride impression. I know, it was bad. It's fine. I have to say, his armor is pretty damn cool. I love the gold, it looks real good. Yet you despise others for doing the same. I despise slavers, okay? Totally different thing. I kill in service of the great peace. Okay. It was you not kill in service of yourself. I kill in service of Japan. And in the Tsushima. here you killed Altan but our people know what you did to the others now they're afraid the ghost will come for them oh next. whatever bitch good people have nothing to fear from me what do you believe Ichi are we monsters 
I think... You did what you had to. Goodbye, Yuna. Don't I really let don't what get you that. said bother you. I don't want our own people afraid of me. You can't expect everyone to understand what you're doing, or why. No. But I wonder if I've crossed the line. If we have. We are on the right side of it. That doesn't make any sense to me, because if you're if you're a local you know that the black wolf the brothers all town you know all of them are bad people enslaving children enslaving kids why would Jin killing them make you think that y you couldn't trust them anymore that just makes <sighs> no sense at all I don't know. That just doesn't sit right with me. I'm not a fan of that choice. Um, that was a really good storyline, though. I liked that a lot. Nor Norio's quests are, like, okay, but at this moment, they're not my favorite. I don't know if it's because I feel like I've already done so many of them, and that's why, but... Refugee camp. Sensei Scott said he'd meet me here. He is not here. Maybe someone has seen him. I'm looking for a samurai, an archer. The sensei headed toward the coast. He said you should catch up with him to join the hunt. And you'd know what that meant. Ooh, that's a cool shot. <laughs> I was pressing the button to call Sora and Sora wasn't coming and I was like, what the heck is happening? Because he was already behind me. on our horrendous Tadayori armor. <laughs> Although it's not too terrible black. It really wants me to uh, use my bow though. <laughs> Hello. Alright, I gotta say, this outfit with our mask looks, like, pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. You're wounded. I'll survive. You should have waited for me at the camp. I had a lead on Tomoe. I couldn't risk losing her. Were those her archers? One of them shouted my name. More on the way. Tend to your wound. I'll take them. Okay, plot twist. Tomoe is the person who also did... Also killed a... Lady Mazako's family. Should have gotten him, but you know, I'm not gonna complain. I didn't think I was gonna get him in time. Oh, he crashed! Damn it! Okay, got 
Mine went that time. Oh, he's rolling around. He's rolling around. Not bad, Sakai. Oh, please. I did awesome and you know it. They had you surrounded. Tomoe taught them well. That's not why they outmaneuvered you. If you have an insight, share it. You didn't notice them because you were too focused on finding Tomoe. Even I make mistakes, Sakai. No, you don't. Except with her. Hmm. We should get moving. I cannot wait to meet Tomoe. Not gonna lie. Archers, for the most part. Tomoe has been seen with them on raids all over Akashima. She won their trust. She's a useful tool to divide and conquer, for now. Tomoe betrayed you before she sided with the Mongols. But you never told me exactly what happened. She used my teaching to help a band of assassins. They paid well. It still doesn't explain why she attacked you. Sakai! How does a samurai deal with an assassin? You retaliated and attacked her. I dealt with Tomoe as I would any common murderer. She was your student. I don't make exceptions, Sakai. First, Hironori Nagawa. Now, Tomoe. Don't be the next to disappoint me. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, but why did she work with the assassins in the beginning? What's that ahead? Dead people. They hunt people for sport. Not sport. Practice. They're ruthless. Indulging violence weakens the warrior. Like too much food or drink. You said Tomoe traveled to your dojo to study. What did she do before that? Her mother belonged to a merchant family in Umugi. She never knew her father. Why do you ask? Killing is not learned overnight. Even for a prodigy with a bow. Oh my god, my contact is driving crazy. A taste for bloodshed. Is Ishika Ishikawa her dad? More of Tomoe's work. Archers Don't mind me as I touch my Akashima ally. Like dogs. Tomoe and her allies are too hungry for violence. A killer masters a weapon. A samurai masters himself. You've devoted your life to mastering the bow. To the bow, yes. Not to killing. Now you're splitting hairs. I've tied a wounded man to my horse with a bowstring. He used an arrowhead to cut meat when I had no knife. You're saying a bow is more than a weapon. And a samurai. More than a killer. Hmm. If we can't win Tomoe back, we have no choice. We have to kill her. I trained her. Whoa, that lightning bolt was so I cool. I share the blame for her actions. I will end this. You only share the blame if you encouraged her thirst for violence. I made her my student. I should have seen the darkness in her. You didn't see it, and that scares you. Uh, it bothers me. We're nearly there. We'll approach this like Fort Nakayama. Observe the camp, look for weaknesses. Make a plan of attack. That's right, Sakai. Look twice and shoot once. We will go on foot from here. Hmm. 
All right, let's see how this goes. Definitely a camp for training archers. Whoa. Mongolian style archery. A hybrid. Tomoe is teaching them. Training to fight samurai. We will give them more to learn. We take the camp, then find out where she is. The moment you attack, my arrows will strike home. Check out these helmeted guys first. Oh, fuck. Why are we standing? Oh, hi! Come here, dude. Ooh, they scared. Castle Canada. There's no fluke. You are improving. The way is not here. Let's make sure. Look around. What was that? Mm, I should put on my travelers. Just in case. A supply list. Japanese bows and targets. Delivery locations all over Toyotama. She's setting up more training camps. One in Otsuna, another in Kushi. And more planned. Well, let's go take him out. A message in Japanese. What does it say? Great Khan, conqueror of Tsushima. Before the year is over, your archers will know all I do about killing samurai. And I will deliver the heads of Sensei Ishikawa and Jin Sakai. Tomoe was here. I gave her everything. And she threw it away. She's a threat. There is only one way this ends. I know what must be done. Knowing and doing are different. You are questioning whether I am samurai. Oh shit, don't do that. Don't worry. It was my greatest achievement. But if I must, I will destroy her to save this island. That is my duty. The list we found. We will use it to track down the other camps. And we will end Tomoe's treachery. Sakai! You are a fine warrior. You could become a great leader. But do not question my integrity again. <laughs> oh, shit! little guitar thing just ran in a giant circle around him Lord Sakai please join me the tale of Gosaku awaits you 
Let's sit right What's under so Sora. Tell me about him. Gladly, my lord. Two and a half centuries ago, Tsushima was terrorized by the Red Hand Bandits of Akashima. Around this time, a farmer named Gosaku heard the spirit of a dead samurai calling to him. He found the body, still clad in brilliant armor. Overwhelmed by the armor's beauty, Gosaku stole it. Before long, the Red Hand reached Gosaku's home. Knowing the farmers would lose everything if the bandits went unchallenged, Gosaku donned the samurai's armor. The bandits charged. Gosaku's sword arm trembled in fear. He resigned himself to death, but blow after blow glanced off the armor, and Gosaku did not falter. Hmm. It looks like it's gonna be pretty cool. The bewildered bandits staggered back, tripping over their feet. A mysterious sense of calm suffused Gosaku's body and mind. Impressed by Gosaku's bravery, the dead samurai spirit guided his blade. Before long, Gosaku cut down the final bandit, and the Red Hand were never seen again. Years later, when Gosaku died, the farming families locked the armor away for safekeeping. Each family holds a single key to the lock. Now Terra stalks our island again. The farmers of Tsushima claim to have seen Gosaku high on a hill, looking for a mighty warrior to protect our farms once more. Well, I think I have all the keys. It looks like the stone lantern pillar is fishing. <laughs> the armor is still locked away, and now the Mongols are hunting for it, raiding farms across the island in search of the keys. Which farmsteads hold the keys? We already know we have them. Aoi, Ijima, Kuta, Koshimizu, Ohama, and Yagata. If you find the keys, they say the armor is hidden on a hilltop in Akashima. The Mongols will never lay hands on it. Of that, I am certain, my lord. Sweet. Is it going to tell us where the hill is? It is. How kind of them. All right. Um, we'll fast travel here. Maybe I should put... Well, whatever. I'll wait till I get there and then we'll change it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> um, let's get... Let's get a standoff going. Who will fight? Let's see if I mess this one up. This is gonna sound like so horrible. <laughs> and it's horrible to say, but I love it when they're suffering so that I, I can. I should get, try one of the keys. I can get some more results.
Not that way. Oh, yes, this way. Ooh. Um, up the tree. Oh, God. I always feel like I'm running in circles or climbing in circles with these things. There it is. Kosakuzama. The Mongols will learn of its power firsthand. Okay, that was the easiest mythic quest I think I've ever done. Sturdy. Surprisingly Sturdy. light. Sturdy. <laughs> oh, that color. That just won't do. Alright, what are the perks of this bad boy? Armor worn by Gosaku, defender of Tsushima's farmers. Moderate increase of health, moderate increase of stagger. Killing a staggered enemy restores 10% health. Oh, I was like, what's changing? We get a necklace. Okay, cool, I guess. <laughs> All right, well, we'll be going here so we can try to upgrade some stuff and see what our armor looks like. Lord Sakai, Norio. Hey, Lord Sakai. We've all been worried about Hochi. They need a break. Such moments are rare these days. I used to be like them. I'm not the same man I was the night before Komoda. Uh oh. How bad was it? Our armor's glitching Komoda? out. Bad. We lost everyone. The beach was soaked with so much blood, it was like paste. Be grateful you didn't see it. We rode south all day into the night. A bad storm slowed us to a crawl. Stopped at a farm to sleep a few hours. I woke to screams. The main house on fire. Mongol raiders. They took us to Kaneda in chains. After that, I wish I had died fighting. I think I know where they took Hochi. You want to go now? Yes. I need to remember to put my mask on in cutscenes. Okay, wait. Um. Okay. Where are we headed? A camp on the coast. Mongol ships stopped there for supplies and prisoners on the way north. If they put him out to sea, we'll lose him. Road Sakai, when this is all over, what will you do? I hope one day I can return home, find a way to rebuild. I wish I still felt that way about my temple. Most of my life, my course was clear. Follow the Eightfold Path, raise a family, serve Cedar Temple. You can still do those things. I joined the temple because of my brother. And I always imagined my children and Enjo's children growing up together. Our wives would be friends. 
The Mongols haven't taken everything, Norio. One day they'll be gone. And you'll still have a life to lead. But I don't feel it's mine alone. I have to live for Enjo and the other monks who die. Do you ever feel that way about the samurai of Komoda? Like you owe them a debt. Sometimes. Like my life has to count for a hundred samurai. But that doesn't feel possible. Maybe that's the point. Life before the invasion feels like it happened to someone else. Or like childhood. Maybe twenty years from now, you'll look back on this moment the same way. Lord Sakai! I told you Hochi strongly opposes violence, right? You said he disagreed with the warrior monks. He hates all weapons, including yours and mine. He can lecture me all he likes once he's safe in Akashima village. <laughs> We're getting close to the camp. Challenge me! Mongo God, run him down. We're just gonna do a magical outfit change. Yes! <laughs> uh. Okay, I'm gonna do this one. I got this, I got this. Really? I forgot to change the color of that one. <laughs> That's better. Okay. We have to find Hochi. Mongols are holding someone there. Hochi. Has to be. If I go alone, I can reach him without the Mongols knowing. A Mongol signal cannon. I could set it off. Draw their attention while I get Hochi out. That will be good. After I find Hochi, we'll meet there. Don't wait for me if I'm late. Get Hochi back to the village. I can handle myself. Meet you both back in Akashima village. Set off the signal cannon. I'll get Hochi. Take refuge in Amida Buddha, my lord. attire oh my gosh it changed the color of my hair that's so cool oh oh where are you going where are you going Quiet yourself. Whoa, who's that? Who sees me? Uh -oh. Uh -oh. To the face! Good work, my friend. I should send the Mongols running in. Please save me! Well, I mean, I already killed them all, so... I'm bad at following directions. What's happening? Who are you? A friend. We need to go. I can't leave. The Mongols are returning me to see the temple. The people there need healers. Badly. There's no time for this. I'm sorry, but I must remain here. 
Are you kidding me? Jin! Ho Chi! Norio? What are you doing here? The alarm drew a raiding party nearby. They're almost on us. Uh, damn it. Stay back, Kochi. We won't let them near you. Norio, radio blade. with you, Norio. Everyone is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry. I wish we could end this bloodshed. The Mongols were searching for me. I gave myself up to save lives. How did they know where to find you? They knew I was an Akashima. And they wanted to return me to see the temple. They need a healer. You're willing to treat the enemy's wounded? Mongol or Japanese, we all suffer. Some deserve it. But this means... Has Cedar Temple fallen? I don't know. Norio, take Kochi back to the village before reinforcements arrive. They will seek revenge. I'll meet you there to plan a defense. So does that mean we're going to Cedar Temple next? We're worried about reinforcements, but we're just going to sit down, have some tea by a fire, relax a little bit. We're the ghost, we don't care. Um, I guess I should probably use my techniques, right? Hmm. Sure. What are you? It's right to prevent more suffering. If you kill these raiders, others will retaliate. Lord Sakai. What's the problem? Mongols are gathering nearby, preparing to strike. We should evacuate to Castle Canada. Evacuate and the Mongols will hunt you down. Not one of you will live to see Canada's walls. But we won't have blood on our hands. Go tell the village your plan for them, Hochi. I'd like to see that. <sighs> Norio, I wish you cared about the Eightfold Path more than others' opinions. First you follow Enjo around, now Lord Sakai. Do you ever think for yourself? Wash my brother's name from your mouth. Enough! Norio and I will do the fighting. Everyone else can go hide. I refuse to hide. I don't take lives. But I am not a coward. I, mm, I don't know how I feel about Hochi, you guys. <laughs> he seems like he thinks he's better than everybody else. I'll scout the village. See what defensive preparations we can make quickly. Gather everyone to you. Ready them to take shelter. One of these rooftops should work. Everyone! We need you to gather here! Bring your families, quickly! Here, perfect. No walls. Mongols can strike from any direction. Oh, great. If we flee into the swamp, people will get lost, separated. Easy prey. This seems like a, uh, unwinnable situation. A temple. People could hide there. No need to panic. Just gather here. Incense burners. Add black powder to the incense. Get the smoke nice and dense. Enough to use as cover. 
Norio and Hochi lead everyone to the temple. I'll deal with the Mongols here. They'll blame me, not the villagers. Perfect. But it's not going to go according to plan, I'm sure. My lord, we've gathered everyone. Take them to the temple. I won't let you fight alone. If the Mongols go to the temple, who will protect these people? I'll do as you ask. Keep your Naginata ready. I'll owe you a jar of sake for putting up with Hochi. <laughs> Everyone! Mongols are on the way. Follow me to the temple. The invaders will face the wrath of a samurai. Please, everyone, do as Norio says. We'll take shelter at the temple. Those birds sound like an alarm or something. Need to find a place at the edge of town to wait. Should I have, like, been lighting all of them now, or do I light them when they're close by? Like, can the smoke run out? It didn't give me clear directions! I can hide in the granary. They're here. Now to light the incense burners. I hope oh, okay, the Mongols good. like smoke. God, this is so cool. Does not last long. Shit. Oh, fuck. Not what I wanted. Oh, geez. Nurio. One person? Definitely. Do I care? Not at all. Oh, Hochi. What happened, Norio? 
I was fighting. A Mongol snuck up behind me. Ochi threw himself at a blow meant for me. You're Aww. both braver than many samurai I've known. All right, I guess he's a good guy. Please, I'll give you whatever you I didn't know he was behind me until I heard him cry out. By the time I turned around, he was dead. It's not your fault. Norio? Every time they lifted the cover on the pit, the daylight would blind us. This time, one of them stank like sake. I felt their hands pull me up, but my brother threw himself at them. He was starving, wounded, but he fought them. He fought them so hard. Norio, you don't have to. Yes, I do. They gave up on me and took Angel. They took my brother. Everyone who rode south from Cedar Temple. All gone. Except me. They deserve to live. I'm the one who should be dead. I thought the same thing after Komodo. Many times. I don't know why we survived, Norio. But we did. And these people are counting on us. We're all they have. The people of Akashima are alive because of you. Don't forget that. Because they won't. Poor Norio. Noble Fighter's headband. Only those with worthy ambitions may wear this headband. Uh, no, no, definitely not. Ah, the coast! Don't kill me! What's going on? Take whatever you want. I mean, I'd do that, but I'm like, why are you afraid of me? Everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The what? ghost and the demon sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. Heard us? When? Not long ago. Tearing up the road like starving wolves. What the fuck? How are Sensei Isko and I being blamed for highway robbery? At North, find out who's responsible. Someone is gonna pay for this. This calls for Tanayori's armor. Oh my god. Push off! Start off! Oh. 
Falcon! Am I out? About time you showed up. You're welcome, Sensei. Did I run out of air? Oh, wow. Okay, let me try that again. Did I run out of arrows? <laughs> this just looks freaking ridiculous. You're the ghost. Yeah, and who are you? What happened here? This caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies. Or People sided with the things. Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. It's I called tactic. up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. Rest here. Eat the food I gave you. And wait a while before you leave. Thank you, Sensei. Show me where he was ambushed. Oh, I guess we're not riding our horses? Oh, we are. He just needed to get on his horse first. Quickly, Sora! How did you find me? Someone heard a convoy being chased. People avoid the roads because of Tomoe. When I caught wind of a merchant chancing a supply run, I followed. Why would Tomoe attack supply runs in Kushi Prefecture? There's no strategic importance. No. But Kushidera Temple inspires people. Could be a Mongol effort to break morale here. You don't sound convinced. I think that's part of it. Not all. Tomoe betrayed everything I taught her. Then she betrayed me. And after me, her home. I'll hunt her past the horizon if I must. Heal! There's the convoy. And more victims of Tomoe. Let's see what we can learn. Oh, God. It's a warning to the people of Kushi. From Tomoe. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. Well, let's take it. We don't want people reading that. No other survivors. Japanese and Mongol arrows? Of course. Don't get too close, Jen. Our hair's gonna catch on fire. They took off down the road. And we'll find them. This is the last time Tomoe and the men will ambush anyone in Kushi Prefecture. Come. Where'd he go? <laughs> Hurry! Oh, God. Dismount here. Quickly. There's no time to scout the camp. Bell was rushing in with his Hakama half tied. Why is she here alone? I'll cut her loose. Help. You're going to be all right. What did she say? She said I could live until the samurai came. <gasps> oh no! no. On the Oh, 
my god, I'm like getting my ass handed to me right now. That was pathetic, you guys. Sakai. Tomoe set a trap for us, and we walked right into it. I spoke with her two days ago. Tomoe? The captive. Heard her talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols. I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back. You did what? It could have gone the other way. We'd be standing over Tomoe's body instead. You talk about what it means to be a warrior. How Tomoe undermines that. But you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. But only a child expects perfection of his elders. Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We all choose between life and death. And you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you, ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. Yikes. We still have a camp in Otsuna to deal with. Right, we're here. And Ron is the one who saw their camp? That's right, Sensei. Sakai. Sensei Ishikawa, is all this Tomoe's work? She and her mongos have been busy. A woman here named Ran knows where to find her. Lead the way. Hold on one sec, you guys. My mom was calling me. Okay, sorry about that. She's so cute, she's calling to invite me to lunch. How does she know where Tomoe's camp is? She stumbled on it while foraging in the woods. She's lucky to be alive. Everyone with her was killed. Is your name Ban? <gasps> yes, my lords. The Mongols who did this to you, they were led by one of our own. Tomoe, I'll never forget that face. She used to ride with a group of thieves who lived here. That's not possible. Tomoe is from Umugi Prefecture. She found her way here. Her bow terrorized Utsuna for years. People used to say she could knock a falcon from the sky, blindfolded. This camp you found, where is it? The forest, southwest of here, the, between the river and the western shore. Damn her. The lessons I taught her, the secrets I shared, all oh, wasted. You old fool. Aww. Why did she lie to me? Because would you have trained her if she didn't? Tomoe never told you any of that. Before we fought, I offered to adopt Tomoe as my daughter. Aww. Make her samurai. For someone like her, that's quite a change in fortune. And I took it away. Because she's a hired killer. Because her sensei failed her. She fell back into the life she knew. It's one thing to wreck your chance at a better life. But to terrorize your own people. I am aware, Sakai. Are you? Can I count on you to do what needs to be done? We have a camp to find. Jin is very judgmental. We need to stop Tomoe before she takes more lives. Also, I guess yeah. he's not her biological father then, if he was gonna adopt her.
The good news so there goes that theory. Fell back to a place she knows because she's desperate. She has the Mongol Empire on her side. Excuse me. The more we damage her efforts, the more likely the Khan withdraws his support. We could use that to our advantage, to drive a wedge between them. What if we did, and Tomoe abandoned the Mongol cause? After everything she's done, she deserves punishment. Even if she were willing to fight for us. Would you trust her? No. The woman we spoke to said Tomoe terrorized people here. It must have been years ago. Tomoe would have been young. In her teens. And holding her own among bandits. Hmm. Difficult for someone twice her age. And you never suspected anything. When she began her study with me, she hid a small blade in her sleeve. And she secretly hoarded food. I can see how you could overlook those signs. There were others. I wanted to make her my heir so badly. I blinded myself to the truth. The camp should be nearby. Perfect terrain for archers lying in wait. Keep your eyes open. He cared Just for her so here. much, you guys. That's really sweet. Stay low and find a good place to scout the camp. Up here. We've seen this before. What do you see? Japanese arrows. Of course. Of course. Bodies used for archery practice. Tomoe's signature. Shut this camp down. Keep your eyes open for Tomoe. Ready when you are, Sensei. I'll stay heated until you strike. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> There's a lot more than that. She hit. Oh. The Mongol Saber. Though best known for their composite bows, Mongol troops are also proficient at close range melee combat. They are known to use maces, typically wielded by more heavily armored cavalrymen, axes, and swords, the last of which most often featured a curved, sa curved saber like design. The Turco. Turco Mongol. <laughs> Say that five times fast. Turco Mongol. Turco Mongol. Oh, okay, it's not as hard as I thought it was. <laughs> Saber utilizes a slighter curve and sharp point, with the reverse edge of the blade sharpened along the upper third of its length. That's really cool. No? Oh, okay. What am I doing right now? I see no signs. She wasn't here. Sensei, over here. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Could be Tomoe. The Sensei and the Ghost. I'm getting tired of you two. Your archers are dead. It's over. Ambush. Uh. Go after Tomoe. I'll hold these fools off. Oh, this music. I love it. Tomoe, this only ends one way. <laughs> Keep telling yourself that. I think I'm gonna catch her, you guys. There's nowhere to go, Tomoe! What if I go off You need to work harder, Lord Bakai.
so your old Sakai, the sensei's new pet. And you're a gifted archer who had a chance at a better life, and threw it away. Is that what he told you? Tomoe, why are we talking? So I can warn you to watch your back. My sensei tried to kill me. He'll try the same with you. Thanks for the warning, but I'm here to end this. It's already over. I have nothing. No one. Put the bow down, Tomoe. Whose fault is that, Tomoe? Has she lost her mind? No sign of her. I should tell Sensei Ishikawa. That's my Sora. This forest is both beautiful and creepy at the same time. Sakai! What happened? Well... Tomoe could have killed me, but she didn't. You let her get away. She jumped off a cliff. I saw her. You saw what she wanted you to. She sounded desperate. She is. Because of us. Why does she think you'll turn on me? She doesn't. She's trying to drive a wedge between us. And it's working. No, it's not. Good. But the next time you wonder if I can do what's needed, ask yourself first. Tomoe isn't finished yet. I guess they shall go north to curry favor with the Mongols. We'll find her. guys i have to stop there um we finally finished up all the tales with our companions in this area uh at least i think so i haven't seen another one pop up for ishikawa or norio so i think we're all set down here which means next video i can finally continue with the main storyline um maybe pepper in a few smaller tales in there but i really want to make it main story heavy since it's been a while since i've done that because i'm so excited to continue with that i'm so excited to see how act two comes to a close and what happens to us in Act 3. So I hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did and you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so you know when I post the next one. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I hope you have an amazing day.